Okay. So I, I really just have a question because uh, I've lived at my address for 36 years. And in those 36 years, we've had companies come in who wanted to put a road through the Ordway Preserve. And we had Plum Creek who wanted to come in and do a lot of uh, development in the Hawthorne area. And we've had the DOT who came, wanted to come in and put a, uh, uh, a road in uh, an RV park that wanted to get on Santa Fe. And so over 36 years, I've been to many meetings where, oh yeah, we had a Canadian company wanted to come in and put a fishery in Melrose and suck up millions of gallons of water a day for their business, which would only, you know, benefit them. And so, you know, I always come to these meetings and I ask the same kind of question, which is, you know, it sounds great, it sounds so benign, everything that the, pro the promises of making sure that nothing is harmed, but you know, I always research these companies and find out how many lawsuits are all around the country uh, in the areas where these works have been done and the residents, the citizens who live there are, you know, are finding their waters polluted or finding their cancer rates uh, rising. And so I don't really have a question. I'm just sort of commenting that it's hard for me to believe how benign it all sounds, the presentations <coughs> when there's so many lawsuits out there against Comores and Plum Creek and all these other uh, organizations. So uh, that's my comment. So it's hard to believe. Thanks. Thank